updates video pretty much talking about what's going on in my life and updates and a lot of you guys have been asking me if I'm going to any events soon and E3 is coming up so I thought I'd tell you guys a little bit about what's going on because I am super hyped for E3. E3 is one of the biggest gaming electronics events here and it's definitely my favorite and I'm super excited to go every year and this is gonna be my third year going. Every year at E3, there's always a game that blows people's minds that people are super hyped for, like last year was Destiny and Advanced Warfare, and who knows what it'll be this year. There's gonna be a ton of video game creators talking about games and how they were made, and I know a lot of you guys want to design video games in the future, and that's something I want to do in the future too. I talked about this a couple times before, and I've been thinking about going back to college for game design, and a lot of you guys recommended Full Sail. Like, some of you guys go to Full Sail or know people who are going, and if you don't know already, Full Sail is a university where you can get gaming degrees. A lot of people who graduated from there worked on games like GTA, COD, Assassin's Creed. They have degrees in game art, design, mobile game development. I'll just leave a link in the description if you guys want to check out Full Sail. So anyways, the first time I went to E3 was like two years ago when I went with Konami and I cosplayed as Big Boss from MGS5. It was when the first MGS5 trailer came out and it was super exciting. I keep saying super exciting, but that's what it was. <laughs> It was also when they revealed the PS4 and Xbox One. I got to play on PS4 before it came out. It's pretty much a showcase of all the new technology, games, electronics. They even have cars too. Like the first time I went, there was a Stingray on display. I thought it was a gorgeous car and probably one of the nicest I'd ever seen. And I never thought I could get a car like that at the time, but a year later I ended up getting one, so that was cool. And last year they had a Lambo Hurricane on display, so that's goals next. I wonder what they'll have this year. As far as cars, I have no idea, but games, there's lots of new games coming out. For the first time ever, you'll be able to play Black Ops 3 early at E3, which is insane. I'm not sure if it's gonna be a public or private thing, but we get to play and record gameplay. I'll definitely be doing that, and then I can bring you guys some early Black Ops 3 videos. That'll be awesome, and I'm super excited for that. I keep saying super excited. <laughs> Any gaming convention is going to have really long lines. I've been wanting to try out the Oculus Rift for a really long time now, and every time I want to try it out and there's a booth to try it out at, the line is over 100 people, and I'm a very impatient person. Maybe one day. One day I'll get to wait in a long line and try it out. <laughs> There's also secret stuff I'll be doing at E3 that I'm not allowed to talk about until after E3. I'm playing some new games early. It's so secret that they didn't even tell me what the name of the game is, just a description of the game. So that's gonna be cool. I'll be doing review videos and just follow me around vlogs that week, showing you guys what I'm eating. Every time me and Sausage go to LA, we eat a ton of food, like a ton. Last time we got a dozen donuts for a snack and fried chicken and pretty much the best gluten-free food ever. They don't have good gluten-free food here like they do in LA. Like LA, it is on point. It tastes just like regular food, if not better. Also, if any of you guys are going, I'll be walking around so there's a good chance we can meet up. Plus, I'll tweet whenever I am and we can do a meetup. There's always YouTubers walking around conventions, especially E3, so it's easy to meet some. I've met a bunch of people at E3 like Syndicate and T. Martin and some of the wolf pack and the last thing I have to tell you guys today is I was streaming all weekend I finally set up my stream I did it pretty good it's not the best yet but it is pretty good now so if you guys aren't already you should follow me on twitch I'm trying to set up a stream schedule and stream Friday Saturday Sunday so look forward to that but anyways that's all for today I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure to hit that like button in the face and subscribe to join the wolf pack oh I upload a new video every single day. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.